Hey everyone, this is Emily, the M half of M Saf Adventures. I'm so excited to show you guys this tour of the brand new Whole Foods in Tyson's Corner. We were there four days after it opened. Everything was shiny and beautiful and new. It is the biggest Whole Foods on the East Coast. That's right, the biggest Whole Foods on the East Coast. And it was massive. When you come in through the parking lot, you come up into the produce section, which is really exciting and inspiring. The parking situation is really easy. They give you a ticket at the gate, make sure you bring it inside because they'll validate it for you for 90 minutes of free parking. And it's very easy to navigate, uh, very uh, friendly for people with disabilities, lots of clear signage, it was really great. So when you come in that way, you come up this huge escalator or an elevator or the stairs, and you come right into the produce section, which is amazing. It's huge, It's the aisles are super wide. You could probably have four lanes of shopping cart traffic running through there without running into each other. And the produce is beautifully displayed. It's a massive produce section. And you can go straight from there back into the meat section with the butcher. They have huge dry aged steaks hanging and awesome seafood selection. Very, very friendly, very helpful staff a really beautiful, really uh, overflowing options there. And then you can follow that around through the rest of the store. So that's if you come in through the parking garage. If you come in through the front door, you walk straight into these awesome pop-up restaurants. There was a donut shop, a ramen shop, a tandoori grill, and several other eating options that looked amazing. We were only able to try a couple of them, which I'll show you later in the video. But there's super good food really great displays, really great menu options, and we were so excited and inspired by all of it. We're here at the Tyson's Corner, McLean, Virginia, Whole Foods. It's a great place for breakfast, that's where we're at today. We actually came here last night. Um, it was pretty amazing, but we figured we'd come back and show you guys the morning side, coffee, breakfast. This, if you're wondering, is a... Uh, breakfast pizza with egg, cheese, and bacon on a pizza. And this is a small slice. They literally have like... Huge slices. Huge pizzas with just like, with egg on top of it. They looked Canada. amazing, but we tried to grab a small one. Exactly. So we're going to try that, try some coffee, and... We got a Curiosity Donut. We'll yeah. show you guys that in a minute. And then we had a, an auto pour over yeah. uh, downstairs. It was pretty cool. We'll show you some video from that. And it's a organic Ethiopian single origin yeah. coffee. It's great stuff. There's so much more. Oh, so much. We'll show you some footage of like just the breakfast bar. And Huge I, breakfast buffet. Yeah, and I got this, and you can just check out and go at the self checkout press uh, breakfast bar. And this was just like a dollar thirty eight or something like that. So it's really cheap. So it's really good. All right, so we're gonna try it. Here we go. Go for the yolk. Mmm. There's some cheese. Mm -hmm. The egg comes out. It's very crusty on the bottom. Exactly, I was gonna go for that. Very crusty, the bread's nice. It's, it's light, buttery. Mm -hmm. It has a little bit of a croissant aftertaste to it, I think, mm -hmm. because of the butter, obviously. Really nice good. Nice level of salt seasoning. Mm -hmm. Not too much. Really good. Mm -hmm. It's like a breakfast, it's like an open-faced breakfast sandwich. Mm -hmm. A pizza. A little hot sauce for your hot sauce person. That's true. Would be really hot good. sauce would be good. <laughs> awesome. And I don't like eating heavy stuff. I do love bagels for breakfast, breakfast sandwiches. Who doesn't like breakfast sandwiches, right? But yeah, this is this is awesome. This is really good. We didn't want something really heavy. First thing in the morning, it's like what now? 8.30 in the morning. So this is the second floor. Okay, that we're sitting and eating and it's nice and a little bit quieter than we were on so, You could yeah. probably sit and work up here if you needed to. Yeah. Yeah, this coffee is really good. So you choose your pour over and they have something, I think it's called a pour study. They have it all programmed. One of the baristas was, the, all the baristas were super friendly, really engaging with the customers. Um, finally. We have the donut, which you guys Ethiopian. Get Ethiopian? Wow. The coffee is really good. It's oh, the coffee. It's okay. bright. It's fruity. After I ate that pastry, now it's a little chocolatey. Um, really tasty coffee. Really nice. Right? I don't feel like quite as much of the 
fruitiness comes through um, as I'm used to with Ethiopians, but it's still really, really tasty. It's very bright. Very bright. I'm getting more dark chocolate, but yeah. Yeah, it yeah. tastes dark I'm not a big coffee well. drinker. Yeah. I like her. So this is very fun. Curiosity Donuts, they're, I believe, an independent donut shop that's here in the Whole Foods. They had so many types of donuts. I was trying to decide. Um, this is a strawberry sourdough donut, and um, they also had chocolate sourdough. They had a... Um, biscuit base that yeah. had honeycomb on top and they had a more pastry like kind of like a cronut one they had potato base that had lemon and blueberry on it um they had some really really creative interesting flavors um three dollars for a donut which i think is pretty reasonable right now thank you what do you think it's really good it's a good balance Ooh. yeah It's moist, it's, uh, you know, you can clearly see it's being fried in oil, obviously. I think they, it might have, I, I think, I'm getting this like sort of deep fried oil back from the more than the usual way you put them. It's just funny, it's kind of my Indian side, which is what I'm kind of getting that. It's really good. If you guys don't know what a gulab jam is, that's what this tastes like, at least to me. So. You get a little bit of sourdough in there, though, yeah, almost you do. like a tartness, almost mm -hmm. like a citrusy really tartness. Really it's got a really complex flavor because you get all of the sweet and the strawberry right up front. It's almost like a like a cereal type powder, you know, like yeah. a fruit loops, like the dried fruit you get in cereal, like if they crumble that up and put it on top of a donut and cut me another little piece. Oh yeah. And uh, so that's what the strawberry is kinda like. You get that and the glaze, so it's like a big hit of sweet right up front. You can see this is almost like crispy on the bottom. And it's got a really nice like air pockets inside. Really fluffy. The inside's almost like creamy. It's mm -hmm. like so moist yeah. inside. It's just like falls right yeah. in your mouth. Really good. So good. This is an amazing bar and arcade area upstairs where they had TVs around a bar so you could kind of get that sports bar feel or you could do a uh, serve yourself beer and wine pours over on the side. They had arcade games and skee ball, tons of places to sit. So it was very family friendly. You could get a couple different vibes depending on what part of the room you were in and whether you were there in the morning or at night. During the day, you could definitely sit up there and work. So lots of room, lots of different areas, lots of different things for people to do and experience. Definitely a place I would come hang out if I lived in this area. Uh, we are so excited to have the chance to share it with you, uh, show you all of the details. We hope that you enjoyed it. We're based in Virginia Beach, so we love highlighting things in our local area and you can expect to see more videos like that from us coming up, but we love to show you really fun places when we're out of town and places like DC as well. So we'd love to hear from you. What would you like to see? What did you enjoy about the video? What would you like to see more from us? And we will see you soon. Let us know in the comments below.